Somewhere in the world now you're getting out of bed You're standing on your own feet to shake your sleepy head If you win you take the credit, if you lose you take the blame No one knows where you are and they never will again I went to a big sale that happens here uh, twice a year and I posted a picture on my Facebook and Twitter and you guys asked me to make a video about what I got, a little haul, and I decided to test everything to see if I liked it or not and to show you guys everything I got. On the picture there was a couple of things that were for gifts so I already gave them away so I don't have them here but I still have plenty of stuff that I got uh, for me and some of this stuff also is for gifts but I got like doubles and triples of certain things so I'm gonna start right now so the first place we stopped well it was two sales going on at uh, on the same day it was for a couple of weekends uh, in November and also the first weekend of December but for Lise Wetsy the first brand that is that's for like four weekends and the other brand is Annabelle and Marcel and that was for two weekends, the two uh, first weekends of uh, November, so it's over for that, but there was so much cheap stuff, and their products are really amazing too, so <laughs> I went a little crazy. The first two things were from Lise Wetsy, and these are for my grandma, she asked me to get them for her, but so I didn't test them, because I didn't want to test something I was gonna give her. So it's a waterproof eyeliner, a very black it's called, and the other one is a feline um, mascara HD waterproof, and apparently those two are really awesome. I went with one of my friends, she's uh, called Madame Bonnard here on YouTube, and uh, she told me that she tried this and she really loved it. This one, I think she liked it a little less but uh, I have to add two people asking me to get her this uh, get them their this mascara so apparently they're very good products and the things I got for me was this eyeliner and it's oh there's no really name it's just an eyeliner and it's the color divine lash and something it's just a color blue but I really like it it lasts a long time the blue is amazing and there's tons of little glitter in it but the brush is just so weird I'm not too sure about it and there was a um, like a sample I think you could use, try on uh, there at the cell and the thing was full of clumps and stuff so I decided to try it anyway, it's kind of hard to apply but still it's a really good eyeliner because it stays all day then for my nails, I got this multi uh, base multi vitamins for your nails I got three of those and I've got a base that's uh, like a hardener for your nails this one really helps me because my fingers and my nails they really like always like double so you can basically just rip a layer off my nails like and if I wear nail polish for too long it just it happens after like three or four days I have to leave my nails with no nail polish on them for like a week and I hate that so this really helps uh, my nails not to like double so this is a really good uh, base and this one is supposed to do the same thing but I feel like it doesn't work as well as this one but it's still a really good base but I think if I would have to buy I would get this one because it's <laughs> obviously because I have three right now so that's a good thing that I like it better and the other one is the snail polish and the color is just amazing it's called amethyst the color it's like a little bit of uh, gold and yellow and purple and blue in it but what I really love about this at first I was like that's a little like useless but then I realized that I, it's really gonna be practical for me it's that there's a light in the thing and usually when I do my nails I'm on the couch and there's a lamp right here so on this side I see really well but on this side I don't see anything so usually my nails are always really awful so that's really practical for me I really love it uh, this nail polish could be a little bit more like uh, pigmented I had to apply like five layers I think but still for the color is just really really awesome and it lasted like five like four or five days before it start, started to chip and usually like my nail polish chips after like I think two days because my nails are so like soft that it doesn't help so this was a really good uh, nail polish after at the Annabelle sale I went a little nuts uh, <laughs> with the brushes because they were only 25 cents each and there's one for the lips, two for the eyes, and two for the face, so, and some of those are for gifts, uh, of course, but they're just really good, and I love that there's, like, really, they're really small brushes, so they're really practical to bring 
uh, on vacation and stuff like that. And if you lose them, it's not the end of the world because they're worth only 25 cents and they're really soft. They're really, really good brushes. Then I got a little nuts uh, with the mascaras. I got so many. Some of those are for gifts uh, also. But uh, the first two are from uh, Annabelle and Marcel. And they're basically the same thing. They're the twist, push up and the expendable. But it's a brush like this, then you ca that can be like, it's shorter to add more volume and it gets bigger to uh, add more like length to your, uh, to your lashes. And the other one is basically the same thing. It's just a little like bristles, is what it's called. On this one, they stay like this, and on the other one, they're like this. When the brush is at the shortest, on the other one, it's like this, and on this one, it stays like this. So it's basically the only difference. But I really love those brushes. They're really, I love those mascara. They're really good. The other one is this one. I don't like the brush that much because it's like really like, it's kind of really hard on my mascaras. And this one is just like, it's not tough enough, this brush for me. <laughs> but it's just, when you apply, it's good. It's not the end of the world, but it's still really good. It's the volume precision uh, from Marcel. It's good, but I would go with those ones instead of this one. I got this eyebrow pencil, and it's a pencil like basically any pencil. I mean, it's hard to judge a pencil. I mean, I'm not too picky with my pencils. But what I know is I got the color taupe, and I think it's just a little too dark for me, so that's the only thing I didn't like. But I love that there's a little brush here. It's always really practical. So other than the color, it's a really good pencil. Then I really needed some uh, face powder, so I got a lot of those. They were only $2.25. Usually, like, a powder like this is always pretty much, like, around $10. Because it's 10... This one is 7.5 grams, and this one's 10 grams. So this one is the Skin True. They were both from Annabelle. This one is a mineral powder, like a loose powder. This one is a pressed powder. They're both really good. I love uh, both. This one, I feel like, covers a little bit better than this one. But they're still, like... Um, pretty pretty they're really good both <laughs> but this one I use with my real technique and my powder brush amazing with that this one I use with my elf uh, powder brush as well but it, the bristles are like more dense so it's easier to apply and you can layer it so it's cover more but this one I feel like it's a little bit too pale for me and it's the color doo -doo -doo, natural ivory and this one is light so this one can be if I layer it too much it's a little dark and this one is a little pale so I mix the two together and it looks really great. Then I got those two sets. Uh, these are eyeliners and these are uh, lip glosses. They're the Big Show from Annabelle and they're the color Giggle, Flirt and Shout and Breathe. Uh, it's a really beautiful like orange, a little orangey but kind of gold, a pink, a pale pink and a kind of a little bit darker pink and they're just they're not that pigmented but it's what you expect in a, in a lip gloss but they're really shiny and they stay a long time so really love those and then I got those eyeliner which are the color plutonium solar flare purple zone and atomic red and they're more they're glitter glitterama uh, eyeliner so it's not eyeliners that I would personally wear like alone I wear them on top of a black eyeliner so it gives you like a cool effect especially for uh, Christmas because it there's a red one at first I was like I'm never gonna use that but on top of another color you can even do for Christmas a green eyeliner and do a uh, red line over it I think that would look so cute they're probably gonna do it that's for sure so they stay a long time, they're really good, they take a long time to dry, but uh, they're still really cute. They're really nice to put if you want to do an effect on the bottom lashes, and since it's glitter, but it's like a gel, then you don't get like the messy effect if you're using uh, powder to do an effect. Uh, on your bottom lashes so those are really really cute I also got from Marcel those three powder they're like blushes but it, you can also use them as uh, like highlights because especially this one they're just a little pink and pink and then you get a part that's almost like a bronzer and a, the other part is really gold so it's awesome for highlighter I wouldn't use this too much for blush because it's only a little part that's um, pink and then you got some white also so it's a really good highlighter color this one it's more for a blush because you've got tons of shades of uh, pink and then a really pale one that's nice for highlighting this one is daydream muse 
the Fantasia Face Powder <laughs> and then this one is the Pink Fusion uh, Multicolor Powder Blush and this one is the Wild Giraffe and it's also a multi-purpose, multi-usage eyes, cheeks and face they say so you can use that pretty much everywhere and it's the same thing the pink would be if you only want to use the pink for a blush you only use the pink you want, you have a little like orangey kind of coral kind of a color something something you can use as a bronzer and then the highlighter so you can use it all together or all separate so that's why I thought it was really cool and it was only 225 the last thing is something that's really popular right now but I never got into it cuz I didn't really see the point and I thought it was really expensive and it's this soothing clean cleansing I never say the right way cleansing water and it's like there's every brand are making those lately but I didn't know what they were like what was so extraordinary about it after you take off your makeup with your soap like why would you need this I didn't really know but then Julie the person that my friend that was there to with me to shop she was the best person to shop with me because she knew so much about every product the lady even wanted her to come on her side to explain to the clients what the product were doing when she was explaining to me what this was doing this is basically a makeup remover you probably know because everybody know about it me I just didn't I just discovered this but uh, me I never usually use makeup removers because I I feel like they leave such a greasy like like finish on your face that's what I hate because I prefer to just use my soap I always have a little black after I'm done taking a shower but I just take a tissue and wipe it sometimes I guess it's not the best thing to do because the skin under your eyes is really fragile so this is perfect for me because it cleans your face and it take off it take off your makeup but without leaving that greasy feeling so that's why it's just awesome it's amazing I think it was only five bucks to, instead of like 15 something like that so I got two so I hope it lasts me uh, until the le the next sale which is gonna be in April so I think that's all I got uh, I hope you liked it uh, I'll talk to you soon bye